How come, oh, you'll give it to a whack dude before and then make a good guy wait? Let me make him wait for it. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Marcel Luxton. Welcome or welcome back to the new norm, your go-to for black culture, relationship, and celebrity insight. And today, we got another reaction video, you guys. We're going to be reacting to this video called, Is She Making Sense? Chicks Explain Females Logic When It Comes to Making Good Men Wait for Sex Versus One Night Stands. So I guess this video, we're going to be figuring out why they make good men wait for sex, man. I had I, I have heard about this before. We're gonna see if she shares my own same opinion, and I'm gonna give y'all my reaction on the back end. So without further ado, let's watch the video, man. How come oh you'll give it to a whack dude before and then make a good guy wait? I don't think that you're trying to make the good guy wait. I think that you want him to see the value in you. Sometimes I'm like, all right, if I give it to him too soon, he's gonna think, you know, like I'm not a good girl, or there's no like, you know. He, I'm just a quick, easy F or whatever. And I think that's sometimes what women will do. They'll, they'll, they'll make the guy that they really like wait longer because that's who they really like see potential. And I might see a husband in you and just like men, like see certain women, like, oh, she's wifey material or, you know, she's just somebody I'm going to smash. I think women are able to do that as well. Like, you know, oh, you know, he, he's got a lot of good qualities. He got some good stuff going for himself. You know, I'm just, you know, let me see how it goes and make him wait for it. And then. You know, hopefully that can you guys can build on the relationship more instead of just the sexual and then it can blossom into something else. Women don't want to um, be confused mm -hmm. by the sex and they actually want to get to know, is this a good dude? Like, should I continue down this road? Because with some people like the sex can cloud your judgment um, on, on what a person is or what they could be, you know. So I, I would think that that may have something to do with it as far as waiting. Mm -hmm. I think that's a good example, too. That's real. All right, you guys. That was the clip, man. We got to a lot to unpack, man. They say they make the good guys wait versus guys they just see as they wanting physical activities with. We'll just put it like that, you guys, man. Um, From a man point of view, this is backwards thinking. Um, This is woman, women logic one-on-one. -on -one. They'll make the good guy wait. But the guy they just see as a uh, one night stand, they'll give it to them immediately. And I had heard about this before, man. And it, it, it's not, oh man. The way men see it, if you're a 304 and we find out about your history being a 304, if you got too many one night stands in the background and your name get around the city, it doesn't matter how long you wait, man. It doesn't matter. And I say a good appropriate time for a woman to make a man wait. I say 30 days is the limit, man. Without if she, if she making you wait for 30 longer than 30 days, guys, y'all need to get her on out of here, man. If she ain't serious by that point, she using you and she see you as a trick. But in this logic, they see you as the good guy that they want to marry and tie down, and they trying to trick you into thinking they the good the good woman. But they're not the good woman, man. A good woman is gonna be good. 99% of the time, man. I'm not saying people are perfect, but women have they slip ups, man. And we, we as men, we expect a woman to be up kept, man. We don't like these, these quote unquote three o fours, man. These hookers, man. These street life women, man. And as a man, you got to recognize the difference between a woman and a three o four. And most women over here right now are three o fours, man. They looking for your money. They looking to trick you, to tie you down, to take your money, and basically to get you to take care of them. So you have to stay on your P's and Q's, guys. These women always got one step ahead of us, man, and we got to catch up, man, because these 304s, they, they trying to tie down a good man and still be 304s at the end of the day. They still want to go to their, their nightlife. They still want to go to their girls' night, and all they got to stop. If a woman is a woman, she should be a woman in the streets and you want your woman to be a woman in the streets and a freak in the bed man you don't want your woman to be for the streets <laughs> i'm just saying man you don't want your woman to be for the streets man so watch out for for this behavior man if a woman trying to make you wait man go ahead and get her out of here man that's all i have to say man but let me know 
down below, especially if you women out there, man. I want to hear y'all opinions too, man. Let me know if if you if you do you use this tactic to make a man wait because you see him as a good guy. And I I say at least. 60% of women have this habit, especially black women, you know what I'm saying? Because I, I have heard this before, but it makes no sense. This is woman logic, one-on-one. It's backwards, man. But let me know down in the comment section what do y'all think, man. Um, And this has been your boy, Marcel. Um, Join me to comment, like, and subscribe, and share with the next video. And if you still with me, watch this video next, you guys. Peace. Until next time. Thank you.